back to my channel so in this video as you can see by the title i'm gonna be doing a fashion nova winter try on haul i have like sweaters jumpsuits dresses i only think i have one bottom and that's it and then like a couple accessories everything will be down below in the description box um so you guys can check this out yourselves also my voice is a little bit like congested i can't really hear it myself but when i watch the video back i sound a little bit stuffy just ignore that try to ignore that make sure to like comment subscribe for more content and more videos for me and let's go ahead and get on with the clothes so the first item that i have i have on right now one of their velour um jumpsuit tracksuit sets that they have this is in a hunter green color this one i've wanted for a while like ever since they first put this on the website i wanted it so i finally got it and this one is not the best i don't think i'm gonna actually buy these anymore because of just how they fit and look on me i got this in a size medium like the whole set is a medium kind of have it like cropped up here in the back because for some reason i just don't like how the top fits on me and how it looks on me like the bottom will be so big like this and just look awkward when i put it on bottom stops about right here so they're kind of short on me i wish they were a little bit longer the color kind of saved it so i'm gonna give it like a six out of ten next thing that i have is this jumpsuit right here so this jumpsuit is like really popular on their website it's like the snatch um something snatch jumpsuit Got this in a size medium i usually always get my jumpsuits in a size medium this is my second time putting this on and it's not that bad but when i first first put this on it was so just tight i couldn't believe how tight and like how hard it was to get on it has a little bit more stretch because it's like my second or third time putting this on um it has a zipper right here in the back but i didn't zip it up all the way it's still kind of unzipped and then this is just what the back looks like it's very comfortable actually after putting it on and wearing it after like a couple of wears it will be a little bit looser and like you know more comfortable it's very stretchy as you can tell extra like cloth down here like look at all that extra room that i have like I have a lot of leg room. Anyways, this is what it looks like, and I'm giving this one, like I said, a 9 out of 10. So next I have the same thing in black. This one, I feel like this one is a lot tighter. Maybe because it's a black and like a darker color. I feel like sometimes darker colors are a little tighter than light colors, you know? I did not zip it at all in the back because it was just too... Is this a hole? Bruh. There's a hole on the side now, I guess from me pulling it up. That just took some points off, but... This is what the back looks like. I didn't zip it because it's just, it's too much right now to zip it up. It still has a lot of leg room down here. I'm gonna give it like a five out of 10 because one, it ripped. Two, it's just super, super tight and a little, it's uncomfortable to wear this for me. I don't like wearing tight stuff. So this is one of those like really popular dresses as well. Um, it's like that knitted or sweater type of dress. You can wear it either like on your shoulders like this or you can have it off the shoulder like this. Either one is fine. I wanted to try out white just to see if it was going to be see-through or not. It is a little bit see-through, but I'm not like surprised like it's white. I got this in a size small. It was very tight when I first got it, but it's kind of stretched out since I've worn it a couple times. The back here, that's what it looks like. It's kind of lowered in the back here, like on the back part, you know. I'm not disappointed, but it's just an 8 out of 10. It's nothing really too special. This jumpsuit is very, very nice. Um, I got it in like this green like an olive green color and it's a velvet uh jumpsuit unfortunately it does have like that thing in the back here where it's like a gap of air i wish it was cinched in some more so it can look right but other than that the front looks really nice it has like this ruched kind of material uh right here in the front and these are buttons you can button it if you want to and you can have it as low or as uh, high as you want this one also is a pretty nice length on me it goes all the way down mm, i don't know what to call it but it's like a really nice material inside that's really comfortable i'm gonna give this like a 9 out of 10 actually if this part in the back was like you know how it should be then i would give it a 10 out of 10 but i'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 just for that it's just like this really nice burgundy dress and it has like that cut out here so it's like it looks like two dresses but it's one a little bit of a thinner material so it's not all that thick to wear you know out right now i can kind of see through it a little bit it's a little like sheer and see-through ish you're wearing the right colors underneath you shouldn't be able to like see anything or have to worry about it this is what the back looks like i got this in a size small i'm gonna give it an eight out of ten so next i have this little outfit right here so these are the bottoms that I was talking about. I only got one pair of bottoms in this whole haul. These are like from the same like um, collection as those bodysuits that I got. This pair of leggings is actually not too bad, not too tight. It could be a little bit longer. It does have like a little um, 
not a lot but it does have some stuff at the bottom here so it's long enough for me they are tight but they're not too bad i did wish i went up a size i got them in a size medium this is a top that i've been looking at for years like i remember years ago this will be on there but i didn't ever got it because i thought it would be a little bit too like loose on me which it is it's supposed to be like that but i like how it looks this is what the back looks like and you are able to like reverse it and have this back part in the front you can wear it off the shoulder you can wear it like one shoulder or whatever you want to do bottoms i'll give them like a 7 out of 10 for the sweater i'm going to give this a 10 out of 10. this is the same sweater i had on in that burgundy color but i just flipped it around this is what it will look like if you want to wear it towards the front like this maybe like a bando or some type of something underneath this i wouldn't wear it like this just because you can move and like this is very loose and it can like slip down or slip off whatever so I would probably wear something underneath it if I am wearing it this way. I'm going to give this one a 10 out of 10. Out of everything in this haul, this is probably my favorite item. A really nice knitted sweater. I love how the material is. It's really soft. It's really, it's not itchy at all. It's really soft and nice. This is a large, by the way. It's a large. So I made sure to go up to make sure it would be a little bit bigger on me. And it definitely, like, it's very stretchy. It's very stretchy and nice on me like you can cover up my arms like how or my hands like how i like to wear my sweaters also cropped at the bottom here i'm definitely giving it a 10 out of 10 i love how this looks it's my favorite item out of the whole haul so next i have the same thing in this color gray they only had white and gray so i got both of them this one is a little bit like different and more mm, more restricting i guess and it does not have a lot of stretch to it this one i'm definitely going to score a little bit lower because it's not the same material I hate when you get something in a different color and it's not the same. It's just, it doesn't fit the same as the white one. So I'm going to give this like an 8 out of 10. Of course, I had to go ahead and get some like basic type of shirts, you know, for the winter. First one I have is this black one right here. But yeah, just a simple black t-shirt. It's like long enough and everything so it's not cropped. This one I actually washed already and it didn't shrink in the washer. It didn't do anything crazy. So I love that about it. So this did a good job of holding up its shape. So I'm going to give this a 10 out of 10. Next, I got that same top in white. This one, same thing. Really stretchy and you're able to wear this with anything. I would wear this when I want to layer some outfits or something like that. It's a little bit see-through, but it's a white shirt, so that's kind of expected of it. I haven't washed this one yet, so I don't know if it's going to shrink up. Hopefully not. Um, and I got this in a size medium. I don't know if I said that for the black one, but I got a medium in that as well. I'm going to give this one like an 8 out of 10 just because it's see-through, so... 8 out of 10 for this top. Another thing I actually forgot to show this with like the sweaters and stuff, but I have this cardigan here. So this cardigan is actually a little bit thinner than what I thought it was going to be. Compared to the other cardigans that I've gotten from Fashion Nova, this one is like the thinnest that I've ever gotten. I probably would wear this like more like spring or fall, you know. I got it in a size large just to make sure it would be oversized. And then it has these pockets down here. Um, and yeah, not much else. Okay, my camera just died, but I was saying... Um, not really much else to it. It's a nice cardigan. It's brown. I don't have any brown cardigans, so I wanted to get this one so I can match it up with a couple, you know, outfits. I still will give it a 10 out of 10. I love the color. I love that it has pockets. I like the sleeve length. So I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 for this cardigan. Next, I just have another basic top. Black, white, gray are very essential colors to have. So I went ahead and got this gray one. This is a V-neck. Very comfortable, very soft, very stretchy as well. And then this one, I haven't washed yet, but I don't think it's going to shrink in the dryer or anything like that. So 10 out of 10 for this. So the last clothing piece that I have is this right here. I made sure to put this on last because I did not want to mess my hair up anytime throughout the video. This hoodie I got in a size extra, extra, no. I just got an extra large in this hoodie. I just wanted it to be super big on me, which it is obviously. Like how, like, I like the design of it. So that's why I kind of got it um and yeah this is like a pullover hoodie so it has like the pocket up here in the front this one is a little bit more of a thinner hoodie like when i compared this to another hoodie that i have it's definitely thinner than that one it's about how long it is i probably wear this as a dress drawstring it has a hoodie on the back here of course all right next time i get another hoodie i will not get an uh, extra large probably at large will be just fine i love oversized hoodies so 10 out of 10 for this i have this um hat thing right here what's this called Blanclave, Blanclave, something like that i don't remember it's a thing that has like the hole here and like you can only see your eyes or your nose or whatever on it um this is the white one this one i'm so glad i got because once i bought it they had a black one too but once i bought this this sold out and the black one sold out as well 
so i'm glad i got it i never actually have worn it yet i want to wear it um i can't put it on right now because i have my hair done and then i have this headband thing right here this is very very cute um it's like a little fluffy furry thing um but yeah this one is very cute it's very big also when you put it on it's really big so it's very nice to have this i also have these shoes right here so these are these really cute um teddy bear slippers um this is what they look like i have a pair of these and then i have another one i'm going to show but this is what it looks like it's just mocha or i think it's like a large or like whatever the largest size 11 but whatever the largest size i had is what i got because i want to make sure i had plenty of room these also have like the little things at the bottom here i don't know what that's called but like the little bead thing bumps whatever you call them i thought they were gonna have like actual like you can walk outside in these but i probably wouldn't really wear these outside for the most part i don't know if they're even available anymore at this point because i bought these in like december and these ones these ones i bought in october these ones i bought again in december because they were still available so i'm like why not so these two teddy bear slippers pink ones i got them in a size large and then these ones i got in a size 11. i just wanted the biggest possible size i had to make sure that they would fit me and of course i'm going to give them both a 10 out of 10. So that's all for this video i hope you guys liked the video and everything i showed and if you did make sure to like comment subscribe for more content and more videos for me and i'll see you guys in my next video bye